Diogo Alves was a Spanish-born Portuguese serial killer. Between 1836 and 1840, he killed 70 people. The crimes he committed were all in the area of the Aguas Livers Aqueduct, thus earning the title Aqueduct Murderer. He was sentenced to death and hanged on February 19, 1841. The head of the killer was separated from the body and placed in a flask to preserve it for scientific purposes, where it is now a tourist attraction. Born in Galicia in a peasant family, Alves fell from the family horse while at a young age and hit his head, earning the nickname Pancada. At the age of 19, his parents sent him to work in Lisbon. After changing several jobs and ceasing to write to his parents, he began to drink and gamble, meeting up with innkeeper Maria Pera in her Gertrudes. It is believed that this connection instigated Alves to kill. He began to commit crimes, earning a second nickname the Aqueduct Murderer. He robbed poor passers-by and then dumped them from a height of 60 meters to simultaneously avoid identification and present the deaths as suicides, which he initially succeeded in. Murders on the aqueduct remained unproven, but the jury sentenced Alves and his gang for other crimes, in particular, murdering the four family members of a doctor. Thank you for watching. Like and subscribe if you would like to view more of our videos. Have a nice day.